Now in hurricane season, the Red Cross is getting ready to house people in case of a natural disaster. NBC 6's Alexander Meacham spoke to officials today. She joins us now in studio control, sharing how they prepare. Alex. Well, Dan, first the Red Cross would then first set up two host sites to house evacuees. The Red Cross of North Louisiana partners with Southern University of Shreveport and LSU Shreveport to house people inside their gyms in the event of a hurricane. Then smaller shelters would be established at local churches. They train year-round for disasters. We make sure that we have our equipment ready so that we can go ahead and, and load it up and take it out where we need to. We get our contracts, like our, vet, our vendors, like our food uh, and catering, um, our cleaning um, supplies. The Red Cross works on a 120-hour timeline, depending on when and where a storm forms. Shreveport serves as a primary host site because of the interstates. She says efforts have evolved since the days of Hurricane Katrina, including communication between state and federal agencies. One of the ways we've seen them evolve is that we actually have longer stays with the people that come up. Before, evacuees would be housed for two to five days. With Katrina, it was 49 days. Now it's a longer stay for evacuees so parishes can clean up the damage and restore power. She says the Red Cross always needs volunteers. If we don't have a hurricane, we're going to have a tornado, we're going to have a flood, we're going to have a home fire, we're going to have something where you can use those skills. So it's, it's not a wasted skill that you're going to learn. And she says you can start training to be a volunteer now, and they always need volunteers to work those overnight hours. Back to you. Improved vital here in the last couple of years. Alex, thank you.